Look at this. These are the yummy jackfruit sticky rice we just made. It's very pretty, isn't it? And tastes very yummy. You can prepare the uh, jackfruit sticky rice way ahead before. Uh, just put in the fish and then when you eat, just bring it out and fry with the very little oil. So if you have some guests over, you can make, prepare, you know, ahead. So it's very convenient. Look at this, it's very even. All the jackfruit sticky rice cake we just made. Because we have the mold to make it, which you can see it for the next step. It's very even and very pretty. And after that, you will fry with a very, very little oil. So no worry that we eat too much oil. Very simple ingredient. We have shred coconut. We have jackfruit. We have salad topper. And we have the young um, jackfruit in the can. And of course, cannot miss sticky rice and coconut milk so first of all after wash the two cup of the uh, sticky rice you will mix with half of the uh, coconut milk one cup of pendant juice or just water okay you bring it to boil stir them up it will be exactly the procedure that I have shared with you how to make the sticky rice cake with the pork or shrimp. Then add a little bit of salt. That's it. And just stir it up. This procedure is not cooked the sticky rice completely 100%, but to make sure all the sticky rice absorb all that liquid. And then it's going to be get thicker you know um, so even not completely done but this procedure will have to cook the sticky rice a lot faster and you don't have to soak the sticky rice overnight that's why it's very convenient anytime you want to make the cake you just take it out there and do it like this so it's a lot faster and very convenient that's it now you can see the sticky rice is thicker and all the water absorbed to the sticky rice. That's it, we're done. And here, how to prepare the ingredient. So after you open the can of the young uh, jackfruit, clear the water, then cut into the small piece like this. You will need 70 gram of young shred coconut, or uh, it's okay if without it, it's up to you. 70 gram of the uh, salad topper. For the jackfruit, you will cut into the a small slice piece it like this you don't have to cut it too small because the jackfruit is soft so we don't want to be get soggy okay it's very simple just prepare like that after you finish it up you will put into the bowl and we mix it up Here we go, all the ingredient is ready. Now it's time to make the jackfruit sticky rice cake. First of all, we're gonna put everything into the bowl. Okay, mix all together. Very gentle, mix all together. Very simple marinade for this 
uh, kind of the uh, uh, cake. So after you uh, mix all together, then you just add a little bit of salt. Okay. Remember, gentle. Don't have to press too hard. Add a little bit of salt, and then a little bit of the uh, sesame oil. So the smell is good. The case is going to be very tasty, very light. Okay, and that's it. We're ready to make the cake. You remember this mold I have shared before how to make the sticky rice cake with shrimp and pork? Now we're going to use it. Half cup of the sticky rice, okay, and put into the um, each of the hole there, okay, just like that. Half of the cup, that's just the right measurement, so don't, so it's not too much of the sticky rice. Then close the lid. At this time, you're gonna put the position into the low mode here, the low side, okay. Then press it down completely at the bottom. This way, it will create the three hole, very nice. And very deep. Open it up. Ta da! Do you look at that. It's very pretty, isn't it? Very even. So, next step, we're going to put the um, filling into the middle. Just whatever it takes to fill that hole. Okay? To fill that hole. Just put right in the center. There we go. Don't make it too much. So it's gonna show it after, you know, finish the cake at the end. So just whatever it takes to fill that hole. All right. So all the filling is there at the center. Look at this. Very even. Very yummy looking. So the next step, we're gonna use a piece of the sticky rice like that. Just enough to cover the filling. If you miss here and there, just add a little bit. Okay? So that's it. Very simple. You don't have to get it too much of sticky rice. Okay, just enough to cover that hole, cover the filling. I just love to do doing this. This is the very fun part when make the sticky rice cake. Actually, when you make this sticky rice cake, you can add any kind of filling you want. You eat pork, you eat chicken, you eat shrimp, anything. But try to find this cake more. It's very convenient. All right, so that's it. We add a little bit to cover that spade there, and that's it, we're done. Next step, you're gonna cover the lid. At this time, you will put the position on top, right there, see? And then you will press it down. This time, it just make the cake on top more flat, more even. So you have two positions of the mold to make the hole and to make it flat. There we go. Look at that. Press it down a little bit here and there to make it nice and smooth. You the saran wrap upside down the cake mold. Remove the mold. You will have the three little cake even, nice, and so yummy. There we go. Time to wrap it up. We're going to wrap two at a time as usual. Take one out, spray them out, covered on the top. Again, cover on the top, left, right, fold it over. 
That's it. We have a two sticky rice cake ready to fry. We do the same thing again. This time, you can just watch it and do it again. All right. So these are all the sticky rice cake we just made. Look at that, all even. Very nice, eh? You can do it, no problem. So it's now it's time to fry. Look at that, it's very little oil. Very, very little oil. So you don't have to worry about that. Jackfruit sticky rice cake will be served with the sauce. It's very easy. You mix it up with the hoisin salt and water and then just taste to your design, whatever you like. If you are vegetarian, you can use uh, the soy sauce or the oyster sauce you for veggie. So you can use that same amount, hoisin salt, boil with water and then taste to it. That's all. Thank you very much for watching my video. I hope you like my share and if you do share, share so everybody can enjoy that delicious, yummy jackfruit sticky rice cake. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel so I can be able to share and make more video. And watch out for the next video number six is coconut jackfruit jelly cup. It's so, so yummy. It is very pretty looking. You can prepare this cake way ahead. Could be four or five days put in the fridge. So if you have some um, party or some guests, this is a very, very ideal for the dessert. Everybody will love it. Thank you again for watching the video I'm sharing and thank you for all your support. You have a nice weekend and I will see you next time.